Hey guys, how's everybody doing? Um, so I wanted to do another haul. Uh, well, this is my second bag and my free items that I got from my friend. And I'm gonna try to go through this pretty fast because um, I have a lot to do today. But I wanted to, I was dressed up still for my meeting. <laughs> so I said, hey, be a good time. But then I got started on watching some TV shows and one of them was a tear jerker. So if you see, if it looks like I've been crying, it's because I, I might have had some tears in my eyes. I never cried, cried. But anyway, <laughs> what these shows will do to us sometimes. Okay, so I have this um, turtleneck, brown, long sleeve shirt, uh, kind of a sweater. Feels like a sweater, but I don't. Oh, yep, there it is. Um... So I think this is JC Penney's um, Simono Medium. This I will probably take to a buy, sell, and trade store. I'm not, I'm personally not crazy about turtlenecks. <laughs> um, I'm trying to see, I think the material tag got cut out. Oh, nope, it's over here. And of course I don't have my glasses again. I thought I did over here though. I hide stuff back here all the time. But yeah, I don't see my glasses, so we'll just deal with it. Um, and this is polyester. So yeah, probably buy some trade store. I'm hoping to get some bangers out of this bag. Um, this is an Alfred Dunner. It's petite, medium. This is cute. Um, kind of a cardigan with an attached top underneath. Um, it is pink, it looks like. It kind of looks more red um, there, but it is a pink, and it's cute. I like it. And this is cotton and rayon. So yeah, I will list this and hope. Um, I don't have a lot of petites. Well, now I'm gonna have a lot of petites, <laughs> but um, I don't don't usually buy petites. So we'll see. This is Tamara H. I never heard that brand before, but this would be cute for the summer. Just a striped um, tank or uh, sleeveless top with the collar buttons. This is cute. The um, the tag is worn out, but you can see that it says large right there. So. But I don't know the material content, I don't think, because I think it's part of what's been worn out. But I will probably list that since summer's coming up. This is a AB Studio right there. And it is also worn out looking. I will, I'm not able I think it's a medium, but it's it's really worn out. Uh, but this is cute. It's a long sleeve um, top, pullover top with the black band and the black around the neckline. It's a V-neck. So this is cute. I'm not sure if the the label on top says a material or if it's underneath here. Um, yeah. So the material. Oh nope, here it is. Maybe it looks kind of worn out too, though. Um, this is, looks like semi, no, it looks like polyester and spandex. So, yeah. So, this is cute. I will probably list this because I, it's, I like the blue. <laughs> and this is another top. This is cute. Also, AB Studios. I'm not real familiar with AB Studios, so I'm not sure. But it is also sleeveless. It does have elastic. The black band also blue and green with a black band around the waist or the right underneath the breast um, so yeah it's it's cute it is a medium I'm pretty sure yeah it's a medium as well and I'm gonna say it's probably also polyester and spandex and I am right <laughs> so but yeah I'll list this I like the colors I like the bright colors okay this is a dress this is Evan Pecan, size 10, right there. This is also a summery dress. I like the crossover in the front, um, a lighter blue, 
kind of flared at the bottom a little bit. But it, yeah, this is really pretty. I really like this one. I am not familiar with any of these brands. I want to say these are probably all from like a department store, kind of like JCPenney's or something like that. And I don't see the material tag down here. So let me see if it's up here. Because I know that it's, oh, yep, and it's right here. This is dry clean. Polyester and spandex. And it's dry clean. So that's pretty. I like that. And here is another blazer. Also Evan pit cone. Also a size 10. I like this blazer. It's black and white. Kind of of a box detail. Or square I should say. It's, it's really nice. Got the big black buttons in front. Three of them. So that's nice. Um, and of course it's going to be dry clean. And polyester. And I can't read all of it, but it's, it's the majority is polyester. It feels good though. I, I don't mind polyester when it feels good. So much of it doesn't. So this is like a cami top. It's pink with a gray detail. It's kind of pretty, kind of sparkly. And it is a boutique. Is the brand so boutique is essential it is a medium I think yeah a medium and the material tag acrylic I think no nylon I think it says nylon but it's really hard for me to see without my glasses so I wish I knew where my glasses were at okay oh this is pretty this is another dress this is a MSK size 12 um, V-neck, um, the flutter sleeves. Um, I like that, how it hangs down. That's really pretty. Um, this is a, kind of a longer dress than some of the other ones um, I had. But yeah, this is, I really like this one. Really pretty. Oh, it even has like the fluttery kind of detail, the ruffly detail in the middle. And this is, hey, this is machine wash and it's all polyester, but it feels good. It's pretty. So I'll definitely gonna list that. I have another sweater here, another turtleneck and it's brown, um, short sleeves, it's cute. Um, it does have some peeling in the neckline in the back, if you can see that. And this is Villager by Liz Claiborne. It is a medium as well. I will probably send this to the buy, sell, and trade and see if they'll take that. Um, this is cute. I can't read the brand though, but let me, I mean the brand, I can read it, but I don't know how to pronounce it. I should say that. So it's, it's definitely seeable. I'm just buttoning these up, um, the buttons up a little bit so you guys can kind of see a little bit better of what it looks like. But I like this color. It's a really pretty green um, and it does buttons all the way down. It does have a collar. It's also Kind of sleeveless. I'm not sure what that kind of sleeves are called. Um, let me hold it up this way. This one's a little harder to hold for some reason. I'm having a hard time here. Okay, so this, this is the, the top. Um, it has the stripe detail. And the brand is, and maybe you guys would be able to know what it is, because I'm not sure how to pronounce that. So, Phenophemin? I'm not sure. Um, 
one. It's a medium polyester and spandex. This is the back of the shirt. Really cute. Definitely it's going to list. So, here's another top. This is Access. Also Liz Claiborne. I didn't know she had that brand. So there's that. It's a medium. And you can see it is. Um, says it's made in Jordan. Nylon. Nylon. I think. I have to have my glasses to really see. But this is cute. It's brown. It's it's wrinkled, so I'll have to definitely fluff it in my dryer. I'm not a ironing person at all, but it has a tie in the back. Um, so, yeah, this is cute. Definitely will list. Okay, this is this is Target. So this one will I'll I'll donate. It's apartment nine, size medium. It's a long sleeve sweater top. Um, I forget the name of this design, um, but yeah, I'll definitely list this. I mean, not list this. I'll definitely see if I buy some trade store. Um, yesterday, when I was trying to list, and I just like, I just kind of got a little panicked and overwhelmed because I just have so much, and so much is it was either mystery boxes or these items that were given to me, and so I decided. Um, that I need to be a little bit pickier about what I'm going to list. But I'm a sucker when it comes to listing stuff. So, <laughs> Okay, this is Jones, New York. Signature, it's a medium. It is leopard print. Um, I kind of like this one. It's long sleeves. I kind of like the ruching kind of scoop neck style. Um, I'll see, um, you know, what the value is. I might see if I'm listing this, or if not, I'll take it to a buy some trade store. I know it might be coming out of season right now for them um, to do, to take long sleeves. So that's why the sweaters might go to donation, but we'll see. This is also Casper. It's Casper and Company. I had some in the first bag. Uh, it is a size 12. Can you? There. Size 12. Why does a camera focus on your face and makes everything else blurry? It's so weird to me. I know it happens on everybody else's shows too. So this is polyester and acetate. Lining is polyester. But this is just a cute little red skirt. I wouldn't be surprised if there's not a jacket in there. Um, yeah, but this is really cute. So, I will probably list this. This is another skirt. And Margaret Francis, size 12. There. And it is really cute. I like the design in the front because it has that, like, um, a kind of a the lining look or the sheer in the slits and it has it both in front and in back so that is really cute this is a tan skirt and it has a texture to it so um it does look like it has some pulls but i will take my sweater shaver and get those out because i did that to one of the suits i got last time and it turned out really cute Okay, this is cute sweater. It is requirements. Size medium. Yeah, size medium. And it is really cute. I like the design. It does have a texture in the top part. It does look like it might have some peeling, so I will have to do my sweater shaver. See how it turns out. But it is long sleeves. Yeah, really cute. Okay, this is another top. Looks like you're getting a lot of tops. And this one, the last time I got a lot of dresses, but that's fine. Um, Blue Diamond is the brand. It is size medium. 
polyester and spandex. This is really cute green top. Really pretty. Yeah, I like that. The green, kind of a brown spiral. Not spiral. Um, I don't know the design. Is this, is this kind of like a paisley? Maybe? Maybe? Okay, got another sweater. Craig Carolyn Taylor. Here's the brand. Medium. It's a long sleeve gray sweater. Looks like a shirt underneath. Buttons. Um, and it don't look like... It looks like the buttons are just there for decoration. So they do not count on them. So, um, I don't know. I will... I'll check. See, I never heard that brand. Um, we'll see. Okay, this is a longer skirt. This is a Hardy Bernard. And, let's see. Sorry, I'm trying to read the, I think it's polyester. Um, but it's just a brown brown skirt and like I said it is longer um, got the the pleating throughout front and back um, and this is sorry I didn't show you this I just told you and there's the brand and I want to say it was a medium or does it say it says it's a size tall I'll have to Oh, uh, 12. So I think it's staying tall because it's so long. Um, but yeah, that's that's cute. I like it. Here's another skirt. I think I have one just like this. It is Norton Mc, McNaughton, size 10. There you go. It does say it's a stretch, and it does have a little bit of elastic in the back, but it's kind of a velvet velour type of material. It does have that in the front, kind of a um, pleating of some kind, and then the back. And this one's also longer. Yeah. Okay, I'm going through this pretty fast, guys. I'm doing pretty good this time. Another turtleneck. I think she likes turtlenecks. Um, Carolyn Taylor for By Design. This is a medium. It's acrylic and nylon. Um, let me show you the brand. There you go. It's a really pretty gray sweater. Long sleeves. Um, she has them cuffed, so that must mean that they're long, long. So, yeah. So, we'll see. We'll check on this one. This is a pair of kind of a dress pants. Size 12. It's Larry Levine. Size 12. And let me go ahead and do this. Just so I can hold it up better. It's kind of a gray. It might be blue. I think it's more gray though. Dress slacks all the way down. So very pretty. I mean, and one more thing it looks like. Huh. I can figure out there. This is cute. I like this. This is a ruffly top. Trying to figure it all out here. Okay. <laughs> Hopefully it'll lay for me better when I take a picture of it. But it does have the ruffly all the way around the neckline. Um, it's like a tiger leopard print. Even looks like there's hair on it. <laughs> it's funny. Um, so yeah, this one's cute. I like this one. This is a medium. It is Milano. Milano? 
never heard of that one and let's see polyester spandex so that's it so it looks like I have quite a bit more to um to list and I still got my whole back seat of my car full I do need to get that in so I can go through that I also got a box um, that's actually got my camera mount on it um, uh, from a uh, whatnot show that I attended of craft stuff and so I'll be showing you that too soon so but that's it for today I definitely got to start working I got to do the dishes and clean my kitchen up today um, I work at my regular job tomorrow and then Tuesday through Friday I'm here I'm gonna be listing listing like mad <laughs> so I'm at 555 now in my store so that's quite a bit of inventory and I still got a lot more to do so okay guys nice seeing you I hope you enjoy this video and if you can hit those likes hit the uh, subscribe if you haven't done so already so guys thank you have a great day <laughs> bye